Alright, I've got audio and video recording, and welcome back everybody. It's been about a hot minute since the last summoning video was for Asker, and this time, and first of all, I gotta apologize because my voice sounds absolutely wretched and abominable right now because coinciding with the week that we have a heat wave going through just absolutely destroying everything. It's hot as crap out right now. And coinciding with that, my body decided that I needed a bigger challenge and gave me a sinus infection. So I sound really weird right now. If I keep talking, I'm probably going to sound even weirder throughout the video. <laughs> so that and the heat wave, but that's not the only thing that's getting uh, steamy right now. Uh, not steamy, <laughs> that's really bad. That's not, the, that's not the only thing that's hot right now. Right now we have our Rite of Flame banner, which is pretty hot in terms of characters and in terms of the theme. So that's where I am today. I probably, I wouldn't have really summoned on this one because I probably would have tried to do a free pull for Rinka and that's it, but it's Rinka and it's Moose Bell and I saw that art for Moose Bell. I saw that quality Sotaro art and I looked at those rippling abs and I looked at those, that, that cheeky grin of his and I was like, oh dang it, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be spending my orbs on this one, I can't resist the, the jerk charms of this guy. So, where is the summoning on this better? Anyways, we are basically really only gonna be pulling for Rinka and Moosefell, but I'm thinking in terms of fodder, because I heard that godlike reflexes is inheritable. I'll maybe summon on blue because I've noticed when I try to do a pull on a banner it's better when I have multiple characters that I'm trying to summon on like my fallen banner that had really good luck. So that's what we're gonna do. Uh, two characters maybe three if there's no red or grip you know colorless so hopefully our luck will be good tonight. Let's begin. Speak. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm trying to think because not much has happened between last summoning video and this summoning video as far as I can as far as I can tell I hope my microphone's picking up on my voice by the way because I just realized I I don't know if me being sick makes it sound quieter or not I hope it doesn't really hope it doesn't and I know I'm a loud mouth usually so not much has happened I'm trying to think about a whole bunch of things that have happened recently besides the heat wave that's been going through. I think last time I talked about season two, I was talking about 3D He-Man a little bit for season two, and then season three came out back in August, so that was really cool. And it was so if season three was great. I have I don't want to say I have no complaints. You, there's always criticism of you know you ha if you like something, there's always going to be a little bit of criticism. Crit yeah, criticism towards it. So. I think the only thing I would say I had issues with on season 3, which again, not many issues, but the whole story with the villains got a little helter-skelter, and, it, okay, I know I said it last time, <laughs> I, last time I outed myself when I said I had a crush on Cronus, so we got to see a little bit of Cronus again, but something, something happened with the, with the villain writing between season 1 and season 3, because Cronus went from a terrifying, sinister, cruel monster to kind of just goofy comic relief and I'm like, that's, that gets really unappealing. So, and I, w I wasn't a fan of that. Although I will say that that freaky transformation that Rakaz does, that was, I like that, that was really neat. I think it was interesting how he went from quiet voice to standard growly beast man voice to Quiet, now speaking in first person, and the, and the character designs were great too. I loved all the I loved all the character designs. I liked the designs for the hiss monsters. I liked the designs for I'm trying to think something else. Got it. Oh yeah, Mer I didn't like Merman's voice, but I did like Merman's design. That was awesome. And then they hired Alan Oppenheimer to play as King Gray School. It was so neat. And I was I didn't even make the connection at first until I heard him do the Skeletor voice later, and I was like, wait a second. Something, something in my mind's clicking. I under, I recognize that voice. So they had that, and then they also had who was so. 
it's it's funny because it's like voice actors and you don't really recognize by the name you recognize more by the voice so Wallace Shawn who most people will probably recognize as Rex from Toy Story and he was also that one guy from Princess Bride I don't know what can't remember what his name was but he plays Orko in this and I was, oh gosh it was so cute seeing uh, robot Orko and real Orko interacting with each other and it had a good message too I liked it so Season 3 for He-Man is great, and they left off on a cliffhanger for Season 4, so I really hope we do get Season 4. And I just realized I didn't charge my Mac before recording this, so I hope somehow this is going to last. If not, I'm going to have to do an awkward pause in the video to go, I'm not getting a lot of red or colorless. I know I've said it multiple times. Algorithm in the game. But I think it's a real thing. I don't know about anybody else, but I, I think it's a thing. So, I'm just gonna think about what else is going Oh, you know what? Sonic Fort Frontier. Not Forces, gosh, no, not Forces again. Sonic Frontiers had a trailer recently, and if there's one thing I wanna talk about on that, it's the fact that for once, it sounds like Roger Craig Smith is finally gonna get serviceable roles, or not roles, serviceable lines and he's probably not gonna have a cruddy voice director. So I am incredibly looking for, like, okay. Between Sonic voice actors, if I had to rank them, and I know people are gonna disagree with my opinion, my my ranking for Sonic voice actors is Jason Griffith at the top, Ryan Drummond is in the middle, but like very close to the top, and then Roger Craig Smith is at the bottom. And it's nothing towards him, it's just that the voice direction that he's had and the lines that he's had have been, wow, I just realized I'm getting so many three stars right now, and this is not, it's not good. It would, I was, some part of me was hoping somehow that I could have just done a free summon and then gotten Moose Bell, but I didn't. I did, I did a summon recently where I did a summon on a free summon, and then I, oh, you know what, that was it, it was a Thief Spanner. So, the Thief Spanner that we had recently, I did a free pull, and I got Layla, and because I have no feelings for Layla, positive or negative or otherwise, I decided to fodder her on Michalis? I think that's how you pronounce his name? Michalis? Michalis? Foddered it on him because I am starting a build for my Sonic themed unit showcases. So I'm running Michalis with, I think it's Attack Smoke? Yeah, 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 it's Attack Smoke, I think. So Attack Smoke. No, no, that's not it. Oh my gosh, I'm blanking out here. What was it? It's one of the smoke skills, basically. So, I'm running him with that. Can I get a rank at least? A, like a... Consolatory... No, consolation? With the ab, Like the abs consolation? No? Oh gosh, okay. This sucks, man. If if not Moose Spell, at least give me a rank At least give me my buff gorgeous babe. Okay, there we go. Maybe I'll get buff gorgeous babe from that. This, this is a good banner. I like I like this banner. I like this banner way better than the Thief's banner. But the picks for some of these were really off. So I like Moosefell and Mordecai and... Okay, that's the other thing too. Rika got so disrespected. That wasn't fair for her. This banner is all about her. When we had the Plegian banner, Tharja didn't get demoted. And then when we had the Hatari banner, Nyla didn't get demoted. So why Rinka? It's so, like, that's just awful. Demote Lynn. Lynn did not need the setup that she had. That was so, that was disgusting. Did you see, and I just realized we got two drogs in a row. <clears throat> I'm going to be clearing my voice a lot, too, <coughs> because I'm losing my voice from, I've been, so that's the other sad thing, too, is because I've been talking so much, my voice has been almost, like, borderline cracking and going up into high pitch <coughs> pitches. So I'm going to, be sounding like I'm dying and taking my last gasping breaths. <laughs> but rest assured, I should be fine. Except just sounding bad, that's all. So, okay. Rinka got disrespected. Musco obviously wasn't gonna be Demo. Lynn should not have had the skills that she had. And then... <coughs> ah, crap. I, okay, sorry, I know this is really bad. Peony and... Let's... Sorry, bad coffin. I should have had a thing of water to take with me. But it's too late now, so I'm just gonna have to struggle through it. Peony and Tana, Tana, didn't need to be on the banner. 
I think those are bad choices. I mentioned it before to a couple of people, but if I had to pick who's going to be on the banner in terms of females, I would. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Oh, she's five star. That means I've been on somebody who could have been a demo. Uh, I have so many mixed feelings right now, but she's hot, so I'm not gonna. I'm, I'm not. I don't swing that way, but she's hot. And there's no, there's no question about it. So. Might as well summon again on the other way. So, basically, I would have picked... I'm trying to think who I had suggested. Oh, I, okay, I remember now. For this banner, since we're looking at a bunch of characters with muscle, I would have picked Echidna, because she actually... Echidna could use an alt at this point. Echidna or Catherine, because we got Ninja Shamir, and it's about dang time that we got a Catherine alt. And... I said Effie, but that one, give or take, I think Effie obviously deserves an alt. She had a resplendent, but if we were going for like a true alt, I don't think it would have been a bad idea to include her. <coughs> or <coughs> dying. <coughs> or we could have had, oh my gosh, I'm looking at the audio too. Or, and this one actually seemed to go over well with a lot of people. We could have had Petrine at, at, for an alt on this. I think that would have actually been really great, especially considering we had Mordecai as the Tiger Tribe representative. I was teased though when we first saw the- Oh! Wow! That's... interesting. Okay. I- I can't- I can't complain because I think Volk's I'm not calling him Volka. I don't. I don't care what anybody says. Volk. That's what I'm saying. It's easier to pronounce. Volk is handsome, but Volk is also not what I'm trying to go for. Right now, I am trying to go for Mr. Muscle, Mr. Fire. That's not the muscle I'm looking for. So, hope. Oh, please just let me get new spell. That's a, literally that's the only reason I'm summoning on this banner in the first place is for moose spell. But, oh, you know, okay, that's right. No, 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 we're going for blue for fodder. So, oh man, I really hope I do get him. Oh, and I got to, okay, I remembered what else I was going to talk about. So, recently, I don't know if anybody else watches these videos or not, but there's a guy on YouTube called Sonica XD, and I watch a lot of his Mortal Kombat videos where he goes, he does really good, really good, really funny, really well edited Mortal Kombat videos. It's like an hour, it's like a treasure trove of content, and it's really good, and it's really funny. I, I'd say his, his humor's a little bit cheeky sometimes, I guess, like in terms of a... I wouldn't say it's exactly family-friendly, but it's really, it's really good content. So recently, what he reviewed was Mortal Kombat 1995, which I thought was a... It was a great review, and it was also... Look, I love, I grew, I've grown up on 90s videos, or not 90s videos, I've grown up on 90s movies. We have the 1990, it was either 1990 or 1992, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, which was two years before I was born. And I, lo I love 90s campiness, and I think to, <coughs> excuse me, to a degree, we need to bring back the, the 90s campiness. And that's what Mortal Kombat 95 had, and it had some real gems in terms of humor and stuff like that. So I was watching that, and something, it just, it was interesting to learn all the tricks that they did in terms of cinematography, in terms of what they did to make sure that they were making a movie that was faithful to the Mortal Kombat franchise, because, so like a couple of things they did. So the first thing they, that like one of the things that they mentioned was that they were showing all the character designs for the characters in the movie to a bunch of kids as like a test audience, and then <laughs> when they, Gosh, I sound like I'm dying. When they got to uh, Kano's character design, people got, not people, kids. Kids got mad because apparently they didn't want to use the metal faceplate because the movies that they, the uh, filmmakers had previously worked on, you know, was Terminator and I don't know what else it was, but it was, it was Terminator. Terminator was one of them. So they didn't want to keep using those metal faceplates. So they're like, okay, we're not going to give Kano one. So the kids got mad and they're like, okay, Kano has a metal faceplate. Where's Kano's metal face, you know? So they ended up changing it back. And then the other thing, sorry, I'm like trying to move over. I'm laying down like a French girl right now, trying to <laughs> put myself 
in a good position to where I can be heard and also to where my lungs will not collapse and kill me. So they said they said a lot of the inspiration for characters two forests in a row, really. I can't see the forest for the trees. That doesn't make any sense, but we're just gonna roll with it. So characters like Kano and Johnny Cage and Sonia, a lot of those characters got their inspiration from their depiction of Mortal Kombat 1995. So like Kano being Australian wasn't a thing in the games, because obviously they didn't have a lot of voice clips in the games because of technological limitations. But Kano in subsequent games was Australian because the actor Trevor Goddard's voice got that's a lot of red. Should I maybe just Yeah, you know what? Might as well just summon on the whole ground, get all those reds, see if I can get an extra rank up. I'm probably gonna regret it because I bet at the end of the night I'm gonna end up with no me spell. And that's gonna make me really sad because he's the only reason I'm summoning for him. That awful, monstrous, cruel, almost said cold, but technically he's hot. He's really hot. <laughs> but I will be sad if I don't have him. So, what was I saying? I was saying something about Mortal Kombat. No, I can't remember. Oh yeah, so the game was influenced by a lot of things from the movie. So Trevor Goddard, his accent was, he was just, he was supposed to be going for like a Cockney British accent, but it got in, misinterpreted to a, an Australian accent, and then apparently Sonya's ponytail and cap, the costume, like that was inspired by the movie, and I can't remember the actress's name. Great actress. I love all the actress, actors and actresses in the movie, especially because, um, what, like, just, like I said, you watch behind the scenes, and they said they want to get actors who can act and also actors who can fight. And I didn't realize how ripped Carrie Tagawa, who, oh gosh, I'm sorry. You know, okay, you know what the sad thing is? I always talk about how I'm going to butcher Japanese names. I'm a little bit Japanese. Like, from my mom's side of the family, I'm Japanese, and I can't pronounce these names at all. So, Kerry Tagawa Hiroyuki, he was ripped when he was younger, too. Holy crap. And then Robert Sho was also, like, that dude didn't age at all between his time filming the movie and, oh gosh, wait, maybe I could get Lin as father? Maybe? Nope, it's Shigure. So... A lot, like, from the from the time of the movie to, like, some interviews that I have no idea what the times were. Robert's show was ripped. Like, holy crap. I wish I wish I could have that type of muscle, but no matter how hard I try, I can't. And, ooh, excuse me. I've only got one red. This is, man, this is, like, what would you consider, what would you consider the luck on this? Would you consider this good luck or bad? Bad <coughs> luck. <coughs> I don't know why my throat's so bad. This is not a- this is not gonna be a fun summoning video. People are gonna be watching this and they're gonna be like, Why the heck is she coughing so much? This is annoying. I can't sit through and listen to this. I don't think people can sit through and listen to my videos in general, but if- there, There's a couple people who sat through. I noticed my- That's why I was surprised. My ask for video, so I think somehow I had messed up with the algorithm because some of my other videos just weren't getting a whole lot of views, but then my ask for video got put out and I got a decent number. I got like 80... Like I said, everybody, like these are baby numbers for everybody else. These are big, like big kid numbers for me. So I got 80 views on my Ask Her video. And, oh gosh, please just give me a new spell. I'm starting to panic. Please just let me get the, the really attractive dragon guy. No, Leon. I still love you, Leon, but you're not the guy I was looking for. That, oh gosh, okay. Yeah, no fey pass, please. That is something I will never do. I won't spend money on that. I refuse to spend money on that. Okay, maybe I could just... I, I need Rinka for, for, like, building for merges, but I also need... Oh, speaking... Okay, speaking of merges, something I noticed in some of my past videos... <coughs> whenever... <coughs> whenever I summoned for Priam, I always said the word fodder. And, first of all, there's no way I'm ever going to fodder that man. Even now that I've already completed... Really, this is the same thing, again. Just different positions this time. There is no way, even if I, I've already completed 10 merges, I'm never gonna fodder Priam. I'm just gonna keep building multiple Priams in singular. Okay, that's good, this, he's, I forgot he's not the five star. We need to start bringing back four star demotes, not just like one to the, the unit. Like, I'm pretty sure other characters could be added again. So, what was I talking about again? I can't even remember. Uh, it's videos. I was talking about Mortal Kombat and I lost that. Now I've lost track of everything. 
And I'm gonna panic because I don't see a boost spell. <laughs> Please. Let's see. Am I am I being punished for my simping? Is that what it is? This isn't fair. You know. Oh gosh. You know what? I okay. Yes, I'm tired of three houses. Um, banners, but I would not complain if they put if they had put Balthus on this banner. Or Dudu, but I don't know if Dudu would be on this. He would look so, Dudu would look so good in uh, Flame Tribe garb though. Really? He would? Sorry, I know. I'm just fawning over the, fawning over men in this video. That's all I can think of. What was I talking about though? Now I'm, now I'm really bugged. I don't know. I don't remember exactly what it was I was talking about. I think I was talking. Well, anyways, let's just go. Back. I know everybody's gonna be screaming in the comments because it's gonna be super frustrating when something like that happens. So, anyways, back to the Mortal Kombat video. So, Mortal Kombat '95 was fun, influential. <laughs> please, <coughs> crap, <coughs> not that. But please check out Sonic XD's videos. They're super funny. I love watching those, and. I'm trying to- th oh, you know what? Radical Soda did another video recently, too. He did- he did two videos. He did a Bayonetta 2 video, and then he also did a Pokemon cards video. And, okay, first of all, I gotta say, I- I don't collect Pokemon- That's a, okay, you know what? Oh, Morgan, my son! My child, my baby. I just wish you didn't break the streak. Because now I can't- I- I really have a feeling I'm not gonna get misspelled. I- This scares me. He's literally the only character I wanted. I am getting everything but misspell. I just want that awful, wretched, freaking drop-dead gorgeous man, and I- I'm not getting that. If I don't get it tonight, I'll just keep trying to summon. And if not, then it simply was not meant to be. What was my li I think the only times- the only times in my videos where I haven't gotten- Oh gosh. Every single one of these that I get, and I don't get boost spell, I start to panic. I had 300 orbs! And I- okay, please, 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 just let me get them on this round. Oh no, not three star forest! <laughs> This sucks. I will say though, and I mentioned it to somebody else, that I really think that between Moosebell and Nipple with their first alts, Nipple got the short end of the stick. I don't know, I don't know what everybody else thinks, but Moosebell ended up way, you know, way more at the top. He got a, an alt that has a cool character design. Like, okay, nothing against Nipple's artist, because, you know, Nipple drew, Nipple's artist drew Nipple, and like first moose spell and also ninja levitain who was another unit that i hadn't gotten when i did my summoning video but <coughs> dying hang on a minute <coughs> oh okay please please <laughs> please i'm getting oh my gosh can't you see i'm desperate what was that oh gosh what was that line oh yeah can't you see i'm desperate mr valiant what whatever that line was from who friend roger rabbit I just, I, oh gosh, please just let me simp unpunished, please just let me, let me thirst for this guy. I should, oh man, I, I don't know, I, if my sister, I've already got, I don't know if it's inappropriate or not, I've already, yeah, I'm not gonna say it. My sister has dubbed me the name Candle, um, word for a woman that you, that is not seen as high classy. Um, because I have an obsession with Yankee Candles, but now right, my oh my gosh, why am I getting so many Lissas? You know, if I could at least be compensated with a, a good, at least, a good con- Okay, I don't want to say good consolation, because Morgan's a good con consolation. Volk is a good consolation. What other- how the- I know I had one more five star- oh, well, no, that was Rinka, I think. I just- Want Moose Spell, please. I just want the dragon guy, that's all I care about. And there's. Oh gosh. This sucks, this sucks so bad. My luck sucks. Unless I manage to pull a Tibarn, like I did last time. I think what I'm gonna do next time, I. 
Well, if one of, one of my next videos, okay, Tatiana, you scared me for a second because that's not. It, oh god, I don't know what it is too. I've had so many issues trying to build units up in this game. <coughs> ah, dead. Units that get added to the, the four star pool, I have such a difficult time building up because I don't tend to get them. Do you know how long it's taken for me to get. I'm trying to think. Atlas! I haven't gotten Atlas yet. That's what really sucks. I would like to get at least one Atlas right now because he was the. Like one of the few Valentia characters on the Valentia banner. Oh, uh, okay. Um. Alright, let's just do this really quick. I don't want to have to cut and edit this, so. I'm just gonna set it, send these all home really quick. Goodbye, goodbye, good friends, goodbye. Let's see. I'm not even trying to sing that on key because I can't sing right now. I I like to sing in my car on my way to work, and the sad thing is being sick like this, I sound really bad. <laughs> my voice cracks. I sound like a teenage boy going through puberty who can't be part of the choir choir band anymore. And I'm already I'm at 26. Uh, this sucks. This really sucks. Please just I'll I'll actually be cheerful. I'll have more energy than I did during the Asker video. If I get Moose Spell, please let me get Moose Spell. That's the only character I was summoning for. Brady! No! Ah, I don't like this. I I have the awful feeling I'm not gonna get anything. I mean I okay, I got stuff. I got great stuff. I didn't get Moose Spell. That's, that's the one that I want. Although, I did see that... I guess he's technically resplendent? Resplendent Leaf? And I gotta say, that character design's also top-notch, too. He looks really dashing in that coat. I wonder if they're gonna do a resplendent for... Thracier? Gosh, I blanked out. I was just gonna call her Veronica if I couldn't remember her name! <laughs> Stop with the three stars, Clarine! <laughs> oh man. This. Oh gosh. This is so friggin' mean! I'm not getting anything. But, and I know most people, and I, I don't blame you. Look, I do this too for some other people's videos. Skipping through. There's my other boy. There's my happy sunshine boy. But you're not the one I'm looking for. But I will still love you because you're my son. And speaking of sons, I want to know when my son Kana is going to get an alt. Because that poor child has been in the game. And that's the other Amarin. No! I'm just going to be I'm just gonna be screaming over every unit I get that's not misspelled because... Oh gosh, this, is, this sucks. This is so bad. Because Kana has been in the game for a while, hasn't gotten an alt, he was the, uh, Kaze, he was the GHB unit, and the poor kid got overlooked so much in favor of female Kana, but then, thankfully, he ended up getting the better refine, and that's fine, and I still don't want him, <sighs> sorry, I gotta, this sucks. We're at, the thir we're at 30 minutes now, aren't we? Almost. 28 minutes. Okay. Let's see. Now I've got 20 orbs. This is so not fair. It would be super great if they gave me more than one great orb. No! <laughs> All oh gosh. I don't know why I was going to quote Aladdin, I was going to be like, all this for a loaf of bread? But, I mean, I don't know, This is all this for a piece of, for a hunk of meat is what I'm thinking of, but, I don't know. Uh, okay, but, sorry guys, this was a crappy summoning video. This is the absolute worst. Watch, I bet I'm going to get, this, ah, this is garbage. I hate this. <laughs> Please, give me, give me moose milk. No! Oh, gosh. This, this sucks. Look all, look you should have been on the Thief's Banner. Okay, this, uh, I don't, I'm not gonna get it. I know I'm not gonna get it, so I'm just gonna have to grind off screen and hopefully get
okay. Yep, Lissa. I automatically don't like you, Lissa, and I will never like you now because you blocked me. You blocked me from Handsome Man. So, all right. I hope you guys somehow enjoyed this video. I didn't enjoy myself. And I think I can hear my dog, like, sleep talking in the back. So, hang on. Does that pick up? I think that's kind of picking up in the background. That's my dog sleep talking. <laughs> so anyways, I'm going to end this video right now. Sorry that I didn't pull the, you know, the hot guy move spell, but maybe I'll get him off screen. All right, see you guys.